Hi guys, and happy Tuesday. Uh, I hope everyone is enjoying the start to this beautiful week. And I wanted to come on live uh, this morning to, to talk about um, something interesting that I read um, in the Huffington Post. And this article was written a couple of years ago, but I'm always doing some backtracking. Um, I'm always doing uh, my research on what is and what is not working. And shortly after uh, Microsoft bought out LinkedIn and made it much more friendly. Hi, Melissa. Uh, hi, Kathy. Um, once, once Microsoft bought them out, uh, it really shifted things. And the Huffington Post wrote an article about how LinkedIn uh, is the most powerful tool of the 21st century. So I've actually written some content on this article. Um, and as always, if you type in the word free in the chat box, uh, I have actually created a PDF for you guys to obviously print out and take away from this so obviously we can all learn together. And if you guys are coming on, say hi and where you're coming in from. And please, as always, as always, please share this um, into any group um, that you are in because obviously I want everyone to learn alongside of me. Um, I want people to understand exactly how this whole thing works. So again, if you guys can hear me loud and clear, please throw some hearts or some emojis so I know that you guys are with me and I really want to talk about these three important reasons why the Huffington Post said that LinkedIn is the most powerful tool of the 21st century. And if you guys are ready for the first reason why, just type a Y or a yes in the chat box and obviously I will be able to then get started because I do want you guys uh, to understand. Thank you, Kathy, for all the hearts. And again, um, I highly recommend that if you guys are in any private groups, network marketing groups, uh, business groups for your network marketing business, I highly suggest you share this content in there. So the number one reason why um, it's very important for people to understand um, uh, why the Huffington Post said LinkedIn is the most powerful tool. Number one is media exposure. Now, uh, we can piggyback off of that and we can call that social media exposure. So the idea of of having a network marketing business. The person that gets the most attention, the person that gets the most awareness is also going to build the best type of business and the biggest business. Hi Kim, welcome to the live. So the more that you can get exposed social media wise on a platform like LinkedIn, obviously in network marketing, the goal of every network marketer uh, outside of getting leads, which is obviously the foundation of what you want. And I actually spoke about this with Kim the other night is that as a network marketer, you have one job and one job only, and that is to collect answers. So if you're not doing what is required to collect answers, you're not getting a yes, you're not getting a no, you're not getting a not right now, you have actually no opportunity to grow your business. So again, if you're just jumping on, say hi and where you're coming in from, throw some emojis so I can see that you guys are obviously relating to this content. And as always, if you type in the word free, F-R-E-E -E, in the chat box, either now or on the replay, I can then obviously send you a free link to claim this PDF because number one, the number one reason why the Huffington Post, and this is me regurgitating uh, Ariana Huffington's information. 
She states, and her company states, Huffington Post, that LinkedIn is the most powerful tool of the 21st century. So I'm not really sure what it's going to take for people to wake up in a sense that, okay, you know, Forbes.com is writing about this. Um, Huffington Post is writing about this. Social Media Today is writing about this. Uh, BusinessJournal.com is writing about this. And, and I'm just the person that really read all this, saw all it, dove in, and I'm seeing all the benefits and results that it could have for a network marketer. So number one, media exposure. Number two, the number two reason why the Huffington Post says that LinkedIn is the most powerful tool of the 21st century is this. Number two, partnerships. Now, partnerships in a network marketing business is paramount. If you don't have business partners, again, when you're looking at the tree of network marketing, if you're only focusing on the top soil, which are the seeds that are planted with product users, and those product users aren't sharing, they're not growing those roots down deep, how do you expect, how do you expect to grow your business? The, the deeper that your roots will grow, the stronger that your tree will be. And I actually spoke to someone this morning that's gonna begin working with me next week, and she said, Scott, that is a perfect analogy. My tree is about to fall over because whether you have one team-like side that's getting blown out, you still have to focus on that other side, and if there's imbalance, that tree is gonna topple at some point. Or if you're building both sides and you're just enrolling those topsoil people, the product users that aren't sharing, where it's not growing your tree down deep, your tree eventually will top over. So partnerships are ideal. So they're saying, Huffington Post is quoting that LinkedIn is the most powerful tool of the 21st century for partnerships, for business partnerships. So if you're a professional network marketer, you are looking to have as many business partners as possible. It's quality over quantity. The more business partners you have, the greater the business you can grow. So if that all makes sense, please type Y or yes in the chat box. And again, please share this in any private group that you are in, either if it's a network marketing group, if you have a team group, people need to hear this. This is me regurgitating information. Again, my passion is teaching LinkedIn, coaching other network marketers on LinkedIn, but there are clues out there, guys. There are clues. Forbes is saying this. Huffington Post is saying this. Socialmediatoday.com is saying this. Businessjournal.com is saying this. All of the top trending social media sites out there, business sites are saying this. Thank you, Greg. And again, I go by clues. So if all of these top trending things are saying, listen, LinkedIn is the most powerful tool of the 21st century. You know, I remember going to an event and seeing Chris Harder um, and David Norrie speak about, and they came out and they were wearing construction outfits and they had these tool belts. And they said, listen, the more tools that you have in your tool belt, the more people that you can help. So if, you have, if you're wearing a tool belt and it's a Facebook tool and a LinkedIn tool and an Instagram tool, you are fully locked and loaded to be able to assist as many people as possible. Um, and Greg says, the greatest takeaway to all is this just applies to everything in business, not just network marketing. Exactly. But to piggyback off of Greg, to piggyback off of Greg, when you guys can understand that as a network marketer, you are also a business owner, this is a business. So when you start thinking, feeling, and treating this like a business, it will then pay you as a business. So if that all makes sense, please type Y or yes in the chat box. And again, if you would like a free copy of this content, type in the word free, F-R-E-E -E, in the chat box. And please, 
please do share this with anyone that you know could benefit from it, an individual, a team group, uh, a network marketing group that you're involved with. People need to hear this information. So the number one reason why the Huffington Post says LinkedIn is the most powerful tool of the 21st century is media exposure. Number two is partnerships. And number three, number three is just as important. Clients slash customers. It is the most powerful tool of the 21st century to increase your clients and to increase your customers, which also create partnerships, which also create business relationships to grow that tree. All of this goes together. Having social media exposure, attention, awareness, having partnership relationships with those that are interested in this type of business. And number three, having the most powerful tool of the 21st century for more clients and more customers. Why wouldn't you want to use this? Why wouldn't you want to use this? And Melissa, who was one of my outstanding clients in her specific network marketing business in four weeks went from manager to something called one star crystal executive, which is a amazing, amazing residual income that's been created. And Denise says people who are actually looking for opportunities, that's what this is for. And um, again, this is not to poo poo Facebook and Instagram. They are also important keys of this. But if you want to, as Greg stated, if you want this to be a business, you have to treat this like a business. So if this is all making sense, please type Y or yes in the chat box. Please share this with your team so they can understand. This is why I'm so passionate about LinkedIn and growing network marketing businesses using this because listen, if Forbes.com is saying it, if Huffington Post is saying it, that makes sense. I, I mean, I'm just regurgitating things that I read. I mean, this is, this is bring, this is me bringing awareness and attention to all of you guys for really understanding. If you really want to grow a network marketing business, you have to put your, your network marketing business cap on and you got to talk to people about this opportunity because it is a business. You, if you want to go the route of just enrolling happy product users, that's fine. But you can't complain that your tree is not growing the roots that you want it to because it's not happening that way. Because if you just have, again, those topsoil people that are just consuming the product, they're just consuming the product and they're not growing the roots, you can't expect people, you can't expect people to, to build your business that don't want to build it. But on the end, if you're planting that topsoil seed with people that are interested in an opportunity that starts with a product experience that will then go and share it, it just makes sense. So again, as per the Huffington Post, LinkedIn is the most powerful tool of the 21st century for social media exposure, for business partnerships, and for businesses picking up more client relationships and customers. It just makes sense. So guys, again, type in the word free, F-R-E-E -E, in the chat box. I will send you a free copy of this content. And again, please share this with any network marketing group that you're in, any private business group that you're in because people require to know this information. I, I see a significant need for network marketers to be helped in a way to create those businesses that they really want. And I want to show you how. So if you're not on LinkedIn and you're not sure how to use it and you want to see results within seven to 10 days, start really churning that business butter to really start creating that income that you truly deserve, I'm here to help you. So guys, enjoy the rest of this beautiful Tuesday. Thank you for tuning in. And if you're on the replay, use the hashtag replay so I know when you joined and you can type in free at any point and I will send you that free ebook PDF on this information. So guys, enjoy your Tuesday and I'll speak to you soon. Bye everybody.